It is illegal to sell skin whitening products, yet 15 shops have been caught by London trading standards. They were fined record amounts, on average £11,000 each. And for the first time, some shop owners were given suspended jail sentences. There are particular products that are illegal in this country, so how is it that these products are being sold? Uh, it's a combination of demand and it's also just a combination of greed. Uh, people know that if they sell the products and they're effective, customers will come back. We were finding that people were buying products for maybe 50 pence from the wholesalers and selling them for up to 10 pounds. Skin lightening creams are popular in the Asian and Afro-Caribbean communities, but they include poisonous chemicals like hydroquinone and mercury which can cause organ failure and even cancer. We are aware that there's, it's a very widespread problem and as London um, develops and changes, um, there's a constant demand and supply of these products. Those people might say, I want to lighten my skin, why can't I? Well, why I wouldn't recommend it is because of the potential dangers from a lot of these products. Illegal skin lightening products are not safe. With the demand the way it is though, are you fighting a losing battle given that some of these products are available on the internet? The internet's a growing problem um, and that's something that London Trading Standards is looking into more and more enforcement action is taking place. The dangerous chemicals that you've spoken about already, some of them aren't on the labelling, so what's your advice to people? If it hasn't got a European address on it, then um, outright you know that it isn't approved for EC. Secondly, look at the ingredients. If it's got detailed um, ingredients on, that's a good sign. Um, and third, look at the actual labels. If the labels show really outlandish claims about this, the lightning effects of it, it probably isn't a legal product. It probably contains something illicit.